Welcome to the Pirate Handyman, where we teach you how to be self-sufficient and even save some coin for your treasure chest. If you dig what we're doing, hit that subscribe button, and if you hit the notification bell, you'll get notified every time a new video drops. Today we're going to be fixing a leak in the shower. Now, the leak, of course, will come out of the shower head, but it's because it's something here in the, uh, in the handle. So this is a single handle. So the first thing we've done is we've shut off the water to the house because this doesn't have a, a shut off like you do under a sink. We've opened up one of the uh, faucets so that when we open this, it's going to drain the rest of the water out and we won't be getting water all over us. Now the next thing we want to do is, I'm going to use tape, but if you have a, like a bath mat or something like that, you want to cover up the drain. Because as you know, it's a rule in Pirate Handyman that you're going to drop something and you don't want it going down the drain. So the first thing we're going to do is take the handle off here. This is just a cross point or Phillips head. Pull that off. Set this up here. Now we've got another little screw right here. Take this out. And we can pull this off. Now you can see this is nice and corroded. We've also got a little thing here that goes in. Here we'll show you when we put it back together. But this just helps uh, guide the screw. Now the next thing we've got to do is take the collar off. Just using a large crescent wrench here. Got to get it to seat on there correctly. Now because of this corrosion that we've got, it's making it real sticky, so what I'm going to do is get some uh, WD-40 or 3-in-1 oil. I like to use 3-in-1 oil. And we're going to put it on here and then uh, let it sit for a few minutes. Okay, so now we've got the handle and all this off. We're going to have to take uh, <clears throat> this off. And in this case, there's just a little screw down here. Now, sometimes this can be an Allen wrench. Uh, in this case, it happens to be Phillips. So I take that off. See, there's our, our little screw. We'll just set that up here. Now we're going to take our crescent wrench. Get it fitted on here. And there we go. It comes right off. So now we've got our cartridge out. And this is what the cartridge looks like. Just set this right back on there for now. So where our leak is probably coming from is this grommet back here. You can see it's got a little notch in it. So that's probably where it's leaking. So all we're going to do is replace that grommet. We take this screw out. We'll just hold on to that screw for a second. Now we're going to take a really small screwdriver and get this out. Now you want to be careful because there's a thin part right here and you don't want to pry against that because you uh, might cause a new leak. So we just kind of go around inside here, pull it out, and you can see it's in pretty bad shape. And we're just gonna replace it. Now you can see with this grommet, um, this came in a pack that you can get at your, your local hardware store. You can probably get it over the internet too. Um, but it's again nice and flat and you want to make sure that it's going to be the right size so we put it in here 
Got to work it in a little bit. And take our screw. Get it set. And you don't want to cross thread this. So make sure it seats. And then put it in nice and tight. And you can see it's going to start pushing that grommet down in there so it's in there solid. There we go. All right, so now we're going to put things back together. So we take this and put it back in. We'll tighten this up. Take our crescent wrench. Get it nice and tight there. You don't want to over tighten it. Now we'll put the pretty back on. Tighten the screw. If you remember, what this little thing here does is a stop. So what we want to do is we want to make sure that when we put this back in, this little tab that's sticking out right here on top, we want to make sure that's facing in. Okay, you see there are little holes here, and that's where that tab is going to go. There's one on, we have to turn it all the way around here. There's one there and one there. This goes at the top. This is the way it was set up. Just work it there until we get that in there. And we're going to take this screw. We put that in. Now we do our test here to make sure it goes all this way to cold, all this way to hot. And now we put the handle back on. Screw lined up. Put that in there. We've got it to where it'll go all the way this way and all the way off. Well, thanks for watching the Pirate Handyman. If you dig what we're doing, hit that subscribe button down below. And if you have any questions or any suggestions for us, put it in the comments below. We'd want to help you become more self-sufficient and save money for your treasure chest. Smooth sailing.